Hello and welcome to Thursday Thoughts Day. Just back from a sweaty run. What might be my one of my last tempo runs before um, the marathon of the week on Sunday. But yeah, so it's all going great um, and I'm nearly there. Um, but today's Thursday Thought, I just want to talk about how I'm feeling. And um, the reason I'm, I, I can link it to my running, okay, because I go out on this run today. I feel it, my body feels super strong, right? Really strong. My head, ugh, well, I just feel like I'm in a mist and that it won't lift and um, I'm so tired. Yeah, I can't shift it. Um, and why? Well, lo and behold, <laughs> it's the week before my period. So all the hormones doing what they do, we all know that that happens in the week before the period. I think the difference for me now compared to a couple of years ago is I understand that and I understand that next week it will be a different story and I will be able to thrive again um, because of the, the different hormones. Um, and just generally how you feel as soon as you start a period again compared to how you felt that week before. Um, I've been doing a lot of work um, with one of my nutritional clients on really helping her plan and work and eat her life um, more to her cycle so that she can thrive a lot more and feel a lot better. And uh, I've been doing that as I've been working with her, I've been doing that with myself and hence why I feel like even though my head isn't in a great place this week, it's not the week for me to start a project or, um, I don't know, go out and be a social butterfly. It's the week for me to, you know, just be really understanding and kind to myself um, and, and, you know, just close down a bit if I need to. Um, yeah, it's really it helped me understand that it's, it's okay and that's what I'm going to feel like this week, but not to get disillusioned about it because next week I will feel better. <laughs> I know I'll feel better because as, as I've been working with, um, with, with the lovely Claire, um, that has really helped me be a lot more in tune with, with, with my um, cycle as well. So... Um, what does what does that mean or what am I asking you today? You know, this whole Thursday thought thing kicked off with me going, me having a hallelujah moment thanks to a podcast that I listened to educating me on this stuff. You know, 35 years too late, but thank you very much for it educating me. Um, so my, my first question to you is, um, are you tracking your cycle? And if not, just start there. Just start tracking your cycle you know as soon as you bleed that's day one okay and track how you feel physically and how you feel mentally and any other little things that come to the equation like might be in a broken night's sleep or you were craving chocolate that day whatever just 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 start just start your journey of understanding you because oh it's so helpful and then you can just you know live a little bit more and plan your life just that little bit more around you know what what you do at the certain times of the month based on how you feel um, and understand it a little bit more. But I'll share lots of stuff, but I just wanted to share that today because my my mind and my body are not attached this week, honestly. They really aren't. Um, <laughs> and if I didn't understand why, I don't know what I'd be doing. I'd be crying in the corner and doing all this stuff and giving up. But I don't need to give up because my body's fine. I know it's just my head and it's just because, you know, my progesterone is rising and, and all of those things. So, you know, anyway, I hope this helps. Happy Thursday and I'll speak to you soon.